everyone, welcome to Angel Heart Wisdom with me, Lavinia, for your October 24th to 30th, 2016 reading. If you're new to my channel, thank you for being here. I want to thank my new subscribers for subscribing. I also want to thank you for your loyal support and your best wishes. Continue to like, share, and subscribe, and show your love for personal reading with me. Visit my website, www.angelheartwisdom444.wibbly.com. Book and purchase your readings. Email your questions to angelheartwisdom444 at gmail.com. The new moon energizes the sign of Scorpio on the 30th. and We are encouraged to move away from our comfort zone and welcome new ways to live, heal, and and transform this is a time to take a look at things swept under the carpet taking the time to understand the motives of others can enrich our feelings of intimacy forgiveness and a sense of meaning the focus of this cycle is on developing a special project or relationship in order to add purposefulness and depth to our lives powerful new insights into our lives can occur hi leo welcome to this week's reading i will be using the butterfly oracle by doreen as well as a variation of my virtual decks and god's promises for men and women for you this week we have healing from the past self-empowerment relationship dynamics and end of an era so healing from the past is a focus on letting all the old go all the lessons that you've learned okay really understanding the lessons that you've learned healing the past while being in the now really trusting yourself okay you've been through it all and now you could clearly see exactly what you're up against you can make new decisions and new choices okay with regard to um your needs and desires your next phase of your manifestation work okay um feeling that further to last week um bringing in the new new exercise um and honoring those changes within the body this is creating an energy of healing okay i could really resonate with it because you know i cooked I did my exercise and um, I could feel aches and pains in areas where you know I couldn't feel before so I know that the body is really healing and um, letting go of all fears and um, lack consciousness all that no longer serves at this point in time and I could feel it because pain is just a fear leaving the body you know um, certain times we take on things that um, are too much for us and just by having too much pride we are unable to say no or to um, turn others away you know because of fears fears that if um, I don't partake in this or if I don't go along with what he or she wants I'm gonna be left alone okay so those pains and the changes in the body is just fears leaving you know really getting rid of all fears while we heal the old perceptions that we had ingrained in us from the time of our childhood our parents we know that they're no longer true because we're evolved okay we formed our we've learned our own lessons so we could form our own conclusions we are able to see things clearly at this point in our life at this point of our manifestation work that way we could empower ourselves okay um, through the lessons learned okay through going through the trials through learning those hard lessons of the past we are able to sit in the energies of the now okay and forming a stronger connection with our needs and desires our heart okay our internal self our inner workings understanding the self better okay now self empowerment could come through education for some this could be classes 
um, with regard to a particular area of interest, a particular area of study. This could be classes for our business, but being, be, being professionals on, on, on the subjects of interest to us at this point in time so that when we communicate with others, we will be knowledge, knowledgeable because for some, going through those lessons, learning it for ourselves or through education, through schooling, yeah? But remember, life is one big classroom, okay? And by learning the lessons that life has to teach us, that way we are able to make better decisions and choices. For you this week, it's empowering yourself about being different, the new you, moving away from people who no longer serve your growth, okay? Um, people that... Um, you no longer share the same beliefs and choices or views with moving away seeing things clearly while being very grounded within the self okay and waiting for the new to unfold knowing that you're at the end of an era a cycle a manifestation cycle has ended and um, as the old dissipates the new unfolds so even though you can't see exactly where you heading but being hopeful for the new manifestation phase okay being hopeful for the new era the new manifestation work okay because it's always a continuous process so even though there may be drama in your relationships at this point in time this is a time for you to find people that resonate with you who you are at this point in time finding people that you share like-minded views and you could share your opinions to agree and to disagree okay bringing in the new all right and this is so in alignment with the new moon taking place on the 30th so really bringing in the new and if um, your wishes and desires are truly in alignment with your hopes at this point in time the universe will assist you the new moon will assist you in manifesting with little or no effort from you okay so I'm gonna go on to the love oracle for your messages you have to learn what is behind your feelings okay you have to really face your emotional self this week yeah as this says healing from the past you've learned the lessons so you could sense things you've been through it cycles okay you understand the cycles of life you understand patterns okay so you are able to see things clearly heal the old okay and now you could have a better understanding as to why you feel the way you feel it could be about People in your life, relationship dynamics, things are changing. You want to be around a different set of people, you know, and you could clearly see and feel this. So learn exactly what is behind your feelings. Yeah, you've dis discovered your perfect counterpart. Okay, now this could be an aspect or someone outside yourself, or this could simply be someone this could be you your internal self your inner being okay your perfect counterpart this week could be yourself okay really trusting the self learning the lessons of the now so that you are more cautious and compassionate with your decision making process okay you could stand up for yourself and make decisions and choices that you previously could not bring yourself to making okay and they're saying that perfect counterpart could be within your inner self as much as it could be someone you guys just in sync you know it's like yin and yang kind of energies all right so yeah this person if it's not the connection with your inner self this person is perfect for you and a perfect counterpart could be an animal it could be a child it could be a loved one okay you will intuitively know 
what this means to you at this point in time all right but you found your perfect counterpart just understand yeah those feelings for some it could be feelings of love okay feeling love yeah but connect with the inner self strong call solar chakra activation heart chakra activation while remaining grounded within the self okay so they're saying when love is the answer why ask any questions okay so perhaps this could be someone who's very significant in your life at this point in time and when love is the answer no questions need to be asked okay it is love okay so you let me know what you're feeling what you're experiencing this week share comment i'm gonna go on to god's promises for men and women for your intuitively guided message give to others with grace he who gives to the poor will not lack but he who hides his eyes will have many curses okay what does this mean to you this week give to others with grace give back in whatever form you can at this point in time giving back could be just being loving and compassionate and caring to yourself and this could trickle down to others but welcome the new new love new people new environment new manifestations new creations let me know how those messages resonated remember like share and subscribe for a personal reading with me check out the links in the description box below have an amazing week